The Select Shape tool allows you to select a shape so that you can edit its style. For example, let's see what happens when you have a project that has multiple shapes on a single layer, a star, a circle, and a triangle. Now you select one of the shapes in the window, a star. Notice that a checkerboard pattern appears over the shape and fill of the selected shape to indicate that it's selected. Now you can use the style window to modify the fill or stroke colors or change the width of the stroke. So here, we'll change the fill color of the star. Now we select the circle and use the style window to change the stroke color from black to green. After you select the stroke color, notice the bar at the right of the color bar in the color picker. This allows you to adjust the transparency of the stroke or fill. Drag upward to make the fill or stroke more opaque or dark, or downward to make it more transparent. You can also change the width of the stroke by entering a new value in the width field. If you have a mouse with a center scroll wheel, you can click inside the field and use the scroll wheel to adjust the setting up or down. The stroke will get wider or narrower to reflect the setting. The Effect section of the Style window allows you to select from a number of predefined styles if you want something other than a solid color. All of the settings in the Style window can be animated so that the changes occur over time. For example, you can select the triangle and move to a later frame in the timeline to change its color. When you move through the timeline, you'll see the color change over time.